Welcome back to the magical Mara and from the Black Rhino. We've bumbled a little bit down the road and we've got what seems to be all seven of the Angama Cubs. Remember, this is 100% live coming to you from Kenya. Uh, you can ask me questions on Twitter by using the hashtag Safari Live. So, uh, Byron was just chatting about how the lions thin out the herbivores well their moms have not been doing a good job we watched them this morning miss three times while well, they missed a, a water buck a topi and some warthog so moms haven't been doing the best job this morning but hopefully for the cubs they'll catch something today so there we go the little angama cubs i can see one two three four five i'm sure the other two are also not too far around all just flat oh there's another one that's six uh, in the long grass now it's not uncommon for lions to leave their cubs by themselves while they head off hunting cubs tend to ruin most of the hunts they pop their head up at the wrong time decide to tackle mom when the hunt is on so generally by a fierce growl uh, will keep the cubs in this position while the females go out hunting now when we're about a kilometer to two kilometers maybe a little bit more from where we left the lionesses this morning after their unsuccessful search for bacon on uh, the uh, in the morning so who knows i don't think they would have moved too far i think they're probably sleeping around there they're waiting for it to get a bit cooler before they start heading out on the hunt again hello cutie Some cubs are just too wonderful. And as I said this morning, we're going to be getting to know these prides intimately over time. And uh, this is a pride we will be spending a long, a lot of time with, the Angama pride. So uh, they range sometimes all the way up below final control. Uh, but normally they spend their time down here on the grasslands. And it's a very good territory because it's got a lot of food in it, a lot of pigs. And of course, the wildebeest are coming. Okay, so I've got a little little game to play with you. So the Mara Triangle is about 50,000 hectares, which is just over 100,000 acres. And just in the Mara Triangle, who can guess how many lions there are? So who can guess how many lions there are in the Mara Triangle? That is, of course, not the whole Ma Masai Mara. It is just uh, the side to the west of the river. Who can guess roughly how many lions there are in the Mara Triangle. Hashtag Safari Live on Twitter. Now I have a rust estimate. I'm not looking for an exact number. Just a rough estimate of how many lions there are. Now, Joshua is wondering about spotted kitties. Well, we've got some spotted kitties next to us. Of course, the little lion cubs uh, have a spots while they're young, and that's to help them hide from other predators. I'm just going to move forward a tiny bit. Uh, Joshua is, of course, talking about leopards and wondering about the, the leopard population. The leopard, oh, isn't that sweet? Look at that little face peering at us. Hey, little guy. Hello. Sorry, Joshua, I got sidetracked by the lion cub. And uh, it, Joshua, it's a very healthy leopard population in the Mara. Uh, I'm not sure of the exact densities just yet, but uh, 